Hey y'all, this is Ned. And this is Michelle. And collectively, we are My Philippine Dreams. We have successfully arrived at Kawasan Falls on the island of Cebu after an uneventful ride. Now, this used to be the parking area right here. When I was here the last time, this was the parking area. There was an attendant here, and you parked your vehicle, and then you walked across the little bridge to go to the falls. Now, they have you park all the way at the end of this dirt access road. And Mike over at My Philippine Journey commented that he had an issue with some of the guys out there. And they said that if he didn't pay them a guide fee, that bad things would happen. We encountered those guys. We blew by him on the rouser. I just totally ignored him. They were yelling and screaming. And they ended up following us to the uh, check-in shack where you pay your entrance fee. And even the lady was like, yeah, you got to pay. You can only park your bike out by... Um, out at the entrance to the entrance access road here. So we put the bike back there. I locked the column. The guys say they're attendants. Um, we said we're coming back next week with like five people and we're, and we're gonna need a guide so maybe they won't slash our tires or steal our motorcycle. Michelle says, oh don't worry, the browser will be fine. They're not gonna steal it. They're already asking how much it costs. So I hope to God this ends well. But we're gonna go check out the falls now. There's actually people that live here. They got a pretty nice neighborhood. It's nice and cool back here. And uh, the yeah, the breeze is nice. The water's beautiful. And we'll be back in a bit. Pretty nice, huh?
Okay, so our time at Kawasan Falls has come to an end, and it was a pretty good day. Yep. Yeah, so the ride was decent. It wasn't too sunny. It wasn't too hot. Um, it was actually pretty cool. Up here at Kawasan Falls in Badian, Cebu, um, you got cool breezes, and you got very cold water when you finally go yes. swimming. Now, if you're coming up here, I highly recommend bypassing the first waterfall. You can check it out. It's pretty and everything, but everything there is overpriced. And what you do is you wend your way back into the, this, like, two more falls, and you get to the last, very last fall, and there's a place on the left, the very last place you get to. They don't charge you anything for swimming, but we threw them some pesos anyways because they were kind enough to let us swim there. There's a nice waterfall there, a series of waterfalls, and you can actually climb back and jump off of it if you're very adventurous. I wasn't adventurous this time. Other foreigners were, much younger foreigners. <laughs> Much, yeah, much younger and resilient foreigners. So you, You're wishing you were 20 years younger. Yeah, that's exactly what I said. I said, I wish I was 20 years younger. It had balls. Okay, so that's our Kawasan Falls wrap-up. We haven't had any problems with the, with the parking so far, but we haven't got to our motorcycle to see if it's still there. <laughs> if it's not there and it's been stolen, we're going to have a bunch of material to do further videos. So, without any further ado, from Kawasan Falls, this is Ned. And this is Michelle. We are My Philippine Dreams. We'll see you next time. Bye. Nice place. Very peaceful. Very peaceful.